everybody, welcome back. Let's start. Hello, 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 how are you? Hello, 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 how are you? I'm good. I'm great. I'm wonderful. I'm good. I'm great. I'm wonderful. Hello, hello. Hello, how are you? Hello, 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 how are you? I'm tired, oh, I'm hungry. I'm not so good. I'm tired, oh, I'm hungry. I'm not so good. Hello, 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 how are you? Hello, 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 how are you? great today. How are you? Fantastic. Can anybody tell me please what day is today? Just a little clue. Last time we saw each other it was Friday. Then we went through Saturday. Yesterday was Sunday and today is Monday, very good. Monday, today is Monday, Monday, today is Monday. Monday's my favorite day. Monday's my favorite day. Very good. Today is Monday and today is a very special day because it's one of my friends birthday. Mm -hmm. Today is one of my friend's birthday. Her name is Laura and it's her birthday. And yesterday, on Sunday, it was another birthday of my little friend Maria. Yes. So why don't we sing them happy birthday all together? Are you ready? <coughs> yes. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Laura and Maria, happy birthday to you, yay! I hope they had a great day and they're having a great day, okay? So today is Monday, what month are we in? March, yay! January, February, March, and April, May, June, July, and August, September, October, November, December. These are the months of the year. So today is Monday, March, and what's the number? Hmm, starts with three. Zero. Do you know the number? It's 30. Today is Monday, March 30. Today is Monday, March 30. Can you say it? Today is Monday, March 30. Fantastic. Okay, well today we're going to review the animals we saw last week. Yes, super, super quick. What is this? It's a duck, very good. What is this? It's a spider, very good. What is this? It's a hen, very good. What is this? It's a horse, very good. What is this? It's a cat, fantastic. What is this? It's a bird. What is this? Lady, don't look. Very good. It's a snake. What is this? It's a dog. What is this? It's a mouse. What is this? It's a sheep. And what is this? It's a hamster. Good. So today we're going to learn about these animals and what they eat. Okay. Some of these animals eat plants. Yes, like this. They eat plants. And some of these animals eat meat. Yes? 
Some of them eat plants and the other ones eat meat. Animals who eat plants are called herbivores. And animals who eat meat are called carnivores. Animals who eat plants do like this with their mouths. Look. Their teeth are very flat. That's how they eat their plants. They put them in between their teeth and grin them like this. Great. Animals who eat meat, they bite like this. And they've got very sharp teeth. Okay, so herbivores and carnivore. Herbivores and carnivores. Let's take a look. What about a hamster? What is he? Is he an herbivore or a carnivore? No, no, he's an herbivore. Very good. Great. What about sheep? Sheep are herbivores. Great. What about mouse? Mice, in plural. They are herbivores. Very good. Dogs. Mm. Dogs are carnivores. <laughs> Excellent. What about snakes? Oh, snakes are carnivores. They like eating meat. Mm. Or chicken. Mm. Or even eggs. Mm. Very good. What about birds? Birds. I'll show you tomorrow. What about cats? Cats are carnivores. Very good. What about horses? Well, they are herbivores. What about chicken? We'll see that tomorrow too. Think about it. What about spiders? Mm, spiders are carnivores. And what about ducks? We'll talk about it tomorrow too. Okay, so we have carnivores who eat chicken, meat, even eggs. Yes, like for example, a lion. Wow. Yeah, he's a carnivore. He likes to eat meat. Or a shark. Shark eat meat. Or snakes. They eat meat. Very good. And then we've got herbivores who eat plants, veggies, fruit as well. Mm -hmm. Like for example, a zebra. Zebras eat this. Mm. Or a cow. Yay, yeah, they love eating this. And it's very important because also the shape of the teeth is different. Remember, herbivore, carnivore. Herbivore, carnivore. Okay? Yes? Fantastic. Now, I have a little story today to tell you. It's about Smelly Peter. Yes. Written by Steve Smallman and Joelle Drayden. Now, what about Peter? Peter, hmm, Peter, is he a carnivore or an herbivore? Does he eat meat, eggs, meat, or does he eat Veggies, yeah? No plants really, but vegetables. Very smart, he eats both. Tomorrow we'll see what's that. But for today, we're gonna read his story. Smelly Peter, oh, he smells very bad. The Great Pea Eater. Look how many peas. Remember the other day we saw the story of that of Daisy, who didn't want to eat peas. Well, Peter, it's the opposite. Peter mm, loves peas. P 
Peter. The great Peter. Young Peter Pod was a little bit odd. He ate nothing but peas, fresh or tinned, for breakfast and brunch, for dinner and lunch. Though he always had a terrible wind. <laughs> he had a wind and it was stinky. You see Peter eating a lot. Then, early one morning, without any warning, <gasps> Peter turned green as a pea. <gasps> He's all green, you see? Wow! He thought he looked cool. And he rushed off to school so that all his classmates could see him. Yeah, look! I'm green! But... But kids like to tease boys the colors of peas. And they were rotten to Peter all day. At the back of the class, in a cloud of green gas, Peter... Peter thought about running away. He was very sad because his friends, ha 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 ha, Peter's green, Peter's green, were laughing. That night, after dark, Peter ran to the park. The stars were twinkling, twinkling, and bright. He saw a strange glow. It was a UFO. And it came and whisked him. Into the night. Some little green man stared at Peter. And then they kneeled down and started to sing. You are the loveliest green that we have ever seen. Oh please, oh please. Oh, please, say you'll be the king. The king? Wow! They did like him. Peter agreed, so they shot off at speed of the light to the planet of Krell, far, far, far away. Then they asked, they asked if King Peter would like something to eat. And he said, yes, please. Can I have some? You got it. Peas. What is a pea? We don't know what peas are. Pea. We've never heard that word. Asked the cooks and exchanged worried, worried looks. <gasps> For they made him a Krillian pie. Plus a wonderful feast. So that Peter at least had to give half the dishes a try. You see, they made lots of food for Peter, but they didn't have any peas. Mm -mm. They had lots of cakes and delicious, delicious dishes, and he tried them all. The food was all right. Peter trumped with the light. Then they all had a marvelous party. And the funny thing was that they all loved him because he was, what color is this? Grr. Yeah, because he was green. For a while, things were okay for the new king of Krell. Though the planet was ace and he liked outer space. He was missing his mommy, his dog, and his dad, who lived in planet Earth. Yeah, he missed his family. Then, Peter turned pink. Yeah, he's not green anymore. He's pink, like we are pink. I think it's the lack of peas. He wasn't eating any more peas, so he wasn't green anymore which upset all the people of Krell. Oh, you are not green anymore. Mmm, bad, bad, bad. Trumpety King. Now he'd even stopped trumpeting.
hunting as well. They took off his crown and his velvety ground, gown, sorry. There were angry green faces around him. All very angry. Go back to Earth. Then, without a farewell, the ex-king of Corel was dumped back on the Earth where they found him. <gasps> ah. Hey, look! It's Peter. He's pink and smells sweeter. And he's hungry. And you know what? We know what that means. His father said his mommy was also super happy. But Peter said, please, 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 don't give me peace. No, 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 not those peas, no, please, no. From now on, I just want... Mm, baked beans! Oh, no! And now Peter eats every day for breakfast, for brunch, for lunch, for dinner, baked beans. And what color is Peter now? Orange! He's orange, very good. He loves baked beans. Fantastic. Well, that's the story of Smelly Peter, the great pea eater. I would like to know, do you like peas? I love peas. Very good. One little thing, we forgot to say what's the weather like. Hey, what's the weather like? Is it sunny? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? Is it snowy? Or is it rainy? You tell me! What's the weather like? Remember, it's... Great! For example here, it's cloudy and cool. Okay, very good. That's all for today. I'll see you tomorrow. And one more time, let's say happy birthday to Laura and Maria. Bye!